Hello. Oopsies, no. Don't copy anything. I'm back. Um. With more Majora's Mask. So, last episode. We conquered Great Bay and got all the Stray Fairies. This episode, we're going to complete it. By complete, I mean kill and murder the box. This already go. Yep. <laughs> I forgot on Zora Mask. This is kind of loud. Whatever. I got the boss key without having to murder the annoying mini mini boss to get the boss key. Let me sink down. Hey, don't you dare. I'm so happy you get this place done with, I swear. Just um, push this or pull it. Okay, that's good. I like the Great Bay music. I, I say, although this is the most annoying temple, I say it's one of my favorites. I think my favorite is the fourth dungeon. This is my second favorite. My least favorite is Woodfall. We don't like that place, to be completely honest. Okay. Where we're going to need for this fight is Zora Mask, Bow, and if you're 100 percent double defense. Not necessarily, so you don't have to have it, but it's very useful in this fight, because the boss, um, when it eats you, <laughs> yes, it, it eats you, it takes away two hearts of health, so basically, if, if you're doing three heart run, I'd recommend getting double defense. Although it takes a while, I still recommend it. <laughs> or four heart run, whatevs. First time here, I had um, 11 hearts coming into this. But honestly, all I did was I cut out, like, the damage of the boss, how much it does, and I was like, uh. <laughs> since I. After I played this, I knew how annoying this t dungeon was. It took me till the night of the final day to, um. Actually, even. Oh my god, what the heck? Night of the final day? To even, um. To even get the boss key. I got so confused. I wasn't even aware of the boss key skips. Dang it. See, this thing will do 100 damage since I have double defense. Which honestly isn't too much. But two hearts kind of is, since I don't have very much health. I'm just gonna wait here, because sometimes it ramps to the thing and sends you flying off. That's why I'm waiting. See, it does that sometimes. Now I'm just gonna find it. Basically, just hit it with your um, Zora. Yeah, hit it with your Zora. Hit it with the Zora shield. And you're pretty much good. No, yo. Uh, there's also two faces of this boss. This is just the first. Not too annoying. The second phase isn't annoying, really. It's just kind of stupid. There's also a strat that if you can uh, get your, uh, like, very close to it, you can just continue on using the Zora shield. And your kind of just won't move until the second phase. It's kind of hard though. I kind of want to do the dive. That kind of helps. Oop. Okay, here we go. It spawns babies out of its mouth. What the heck? And basically, we just have to quickly get on the platform. No. Okay. I'd be dead by now. Like, right now, I'd be dead if I didn't have double defense. So, double defense rocks. Quickly 
get to the middle, middle, middle. I also don't think that there are any, um, uh, hearts in these guys. I think it's just arrows. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's the way it is. Oh my god. Yori usually doesn't do that. No! Crap! I'm dead! I'm, I'm dead. God dang it! With double defense too. Seems as if I should get more prepared. As prepared as I could get though. Hopefully I can, hopefully I can get a fairy here. Yes, okay. Don't really even need bombs. Fairy! If I can get another fairy, that'd be great. I mean, I don't need another fairy, but it would be great. <laughs> nope, not, not another fairy. Over there are just arrows and bombs, so... That's a fail and a half. Not just a fail, but a fail and a half. Try that again, and hopefully it doesn't happen again. Cause I do well. I do have eight hearts technically, unless I get damaged on my way to the boss, which I do. On the great the boss, and it's going to be fun. Oh my god. My friend does it much better. I'm not good at accent. Oh my god. No! My friend's much better at accents. Probably because he is one. No, I'm joking. One, two, three, four. Probably four side hops would be it. Huh. Also, second time here, the battle automatically starts. There's no cutscene, so you do not want to do anything. Okay, basically, um. I think I did get it up to... No, not exactly. If you did get Yorg up to the wall, just continue on using Zora's shields. Then you can basically infinite him that way until he spawns babies out of the top. Actually, technically, I guess it would be a girl, but... Oh god, that's not good. Especially since I'm human, Link. It's even worse than if I was Zora, Link. Where is he now? There we go. I think I got him against the wall. Nope. Pretty close though. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. expecting it to take this long. To be completely honest, I thought I'd be done by now. Well, I would if I didn't die like a moron. Okay. Now it just spawns babies out of its mouth. Because that makes so much sense. I just love how it spawns me super close to Gilbert. Oh my god. I always get eaten by this. Seriously, like right after. Hey. No. Where's the Lord? I'm gonna think about some. Hey, I actually 
got it. There, dead. I have like no magic left. I have two hearts. Still no magic. That was good. That was a good fight. I could have done better, honestly, if I was able to get the infinite bug. But it was. Oh, I love how I'm just like on the bottom. It's great. Anyway, if you're wondering how I grab the ledge so quickly, um, right after getting out of the water, if you press A, um, you'll instantly grab the ledge. Doesn't save that much time, but it does save a little bit of time. Okay, now I'm gonna need my ocarina and hookshot. Hookshot, because I want to demonstrate something. And that's it, but <laughs> that's it, really. There's still quite a few masks we have to get. Yeah, I love burping. What else? us this. You'll cooperate with us. <coughs> Sounds like a deal. Anyway, so we are down, done in the ocean, never coming back. Because I got the... I got the 500 bag. So there's no reason to ever come back here, and I'm never going to. So I'm done with the worst area of the game. The next area is my favorite area of the game. Okay, don't need Zora Link right now. I actually need Ice Arrows. Now we're gonna, uh, I was about to say hover, but then I realized, no. <laughs> Let's soar over to Milk Road, since that's the closest to the area we need to go. And we'll just get from there, just need a call you button. I'm also done in Milk Road forever. Well, after I get out of here, but I mean, there's nothing left for me to do here. That's. I got Epona's song and the song of healing mixed up because the song of healing is Epona's song backwards. <laughs> so I was like, uh, what? What up, Epona? Now we're just gonna go over to Icona. Hopefully, we can get there before. A certain time. Well, actually, we will get there. No worries. Just kind of need bunny hood. That would do me justice. I just use up all my carrots. Something you shouldn't do. You really shouldn't. Uh, the camera angle with the Pona, like when you're targeting, sucks. Oh wow, that's just neat. I killed him, but I got jinxed in the. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Here we here we go into Icona. So day one at night, I think at the graveyard was. I know that day three is a bottle. I don't remember what day two was. I think day two was a piece of heart, so I'm not gonna go to day two. You've been jinxed. I'm gonna jinx your face. Basically, just going to avoid getting hit by them, so my jinx meter doesn't get longer. But okay, don't need ice arrows yet, so I might as well get my ocarina because I need to play my ocarina. I'm just gonna wait until this jinx meter goes off. So the thing I'm about to do, you know, this thing to get the mask. <laughs> 